Hello everyone, in this tutorial video, I'd like to show you how to use Minitool Movie Maker. With this tool, you can create a stunning movies and beautiful video. I'd been created a video on YouTube channel about how to get this tool. Link in description to see how to download it and install it. After downloading and installing the tool in question, click on this shortcut to open it. In this first part, we will make an introduction to the main interface. The first one, it is the media. It collects all your media file, including photos, videos, and music. And we have also the transitions to add transition like blind, fade in, and dissolve. And we have effect to add filter like black and white cold and vivide then we have text button to decorate your videos by adding some titles and you have some suggested model you have also captions and and credit then we have motion to add some effects like pan zoom in and zoom out and you have template button use a various movies template to easily and quickly create a movie and you have some suggested model for travel love family friends and festival then we have export button we will see this button in the next tutorial video and you have bar menu it hides some feature like file help and skin for skin you have light skin and dark skin mini tool movie maker interface consists of three parts the first one is media library is the source for all media including photos videos and music file it also contains transitions effects and text click on this import media file button to import your file including videos photos and music select the file that you want to add then click on open after that drag it into timeline and preview window it shows the video which is currently being played in timeline or storyboard this is player control volume and time code then you have view exists for screen button this is the timeline where you assemble the media clips and where we have and the button redo and button to delete unwanted clips and scissor button to split or trim a video then we have video speed controller to control video speed like slow down or speed up video then you have zoom to fit timeline you can click on zoom to fit timeline button to adjust all clips position to fit timeline we will see an example so click on import media file i will add a photo select and drag it into video track then I want to add text I will use captions 
select and drag it into text band now when when i when i click on zoom to fit timeline it is for exact position for all elements In this tutorial, I try to show you the main interface and in the second part, we will edit a video as example. Thanks for watching and see you for next video.